My name is Drika Galati and myself and Mandy Go are fourth year medical students at Queen's University Belfast. While placements have been suspended, we've been creating daily multiple choice questions on Instagram. As you can see here, our MCQs consist of a short clinical scenario that students can answer using the Instagram quiz function. All our MCQs are saved into our page and we currently have over 600 students from across the UK engaging daily with our page. The idea to start creating MCQs via Instagram stemmed from the popularity of online question banks among medical students and the increasing number of doctors using Instagram for medical education. However, unlike these question banks, Instagram is free to use and utilise the pre-existing platform that many students already use for non-educational purposes, making learning more opportunistic. We are currently in the process of collecting feedback on delivering medical education using this medium. However, current feedback from an online survey we performed showed that the use of Instagram as an educational resource has increased by 50% since the suspension of placements. As a result, among our survey respondents, Instagram was more popular than traditional learning resources such as textbooks and YouTube that medical students are known to use. All our survey respondents said that they found Instagram to be accessible and found our MCQs to be relevant to their learning. The main challenges that we found as creators in using Instagram was that our longer posts had substantially less engagement and many students only viewed the questions without actually answering via the quiz function. This is something that we're planning to look into in the future. In conclusion, Instagram is a novel platform for where medical education can take place. It's accessible with a peer-to-peer -peer approach. Further research needs to be undertaken as to the wider role of Instagram in medical education and the quality of teaching on the platform.